Hey guys, so I'm sorry that this is like the setup right now, but in hostel tour blog, me staying at a hostel. Okay. This is the hostel I'm staying at. It's Banana Bungalow. It's in West Hollywood. So this is the view of the lounge where the main office is at and also where you can catch the elevator to the second floor. I'm just walking around and as you can see I took terrible video footage because I was nervous about getting caught filming. It reminds me of a hospital. This is different footage. This is from the morning but if you walk forward down the hall you reach the kitchen and this is what it looks like during daytime. It's nice and here's a clip of me making myself toast. As you guys can see, the kitchen is big, it's free to use, they have fridges for everybody, and they even have a bin for free food, and you can do your dishes here and cook. They do have free food in the morning. Now I'm walking to the karaoke lounge, which is on the basement. You'll see how it looks like right now. You take the stairs down to the basement, and then you can see as you walk down, there's a booth where you can watch TV, there's a computer, and it's a place to relax. It's really compelling at night. I would hang around by this computer and just type what's ever in my mind because I had nothing to do. And it's free Wi-Fi. This is a laundry room. It costs $125 per load, but honestly, it's really cheap. So now I'm going to take you guys to the second floor, which is my favorite part of the hostel because it looks fucking creepy. So you do get a choice of taking the elevator or the stairs. In this video, I take the stairs. I recorded it backwards, that's why I'm walking forwards, if that makes any sense. But trust me, you take, I took the stairs upstairs to get to the second floor. This is what the second floor looks like. It gives me hospital vibes, which I enjoy because it gives me an eerie feeling of like, wow, I'm not in the year 2020, I'm in like the 90s, if that makes any sense. But I'm going to give you a tour of the two bathrooms because there are two bathrooms on this floor. Here's the first bathroom and over here you can see me. So hey guys, you know, just feeling myself or whatever. I'm playing. And then here's the balcony where, you know, this girl is just relaxing. Here's the second bathroom which was the shower that I used the most because honestly it was the closest to my room. And I fucked with it. It was tiny, it smelled good. And here's me by the way. This footage was from nighttime when I actually was showering, so here's a little ASMR for you in the background. I saved the best for last, which is my room. I was in room 210 and this is how I unlock it. With an electric key, as you can see. This is my room. This is my bed. I got the top bunk, but the room gives me summer camp vibes. It's very cute and eerie. That's all there is to the uh, also that I recorded. There's more to it, but I didn't film all of it because it was pre-recorded and I did a voiceover. But yeah, here's me guys. Thank you.